One on one cut drill is uh, one of the drills that we do here that teaches our linebackers how to defeat low blocks. Uh, it's a great um, tool to use that allows our kids to execute proper technique and allows our linebackers to stay on their feet and uh, defeat blocks and make plays. The major emphasis is that you got to constantly tell them to bend at their knees and not their waist and to stay square. What we do to set up the drill is that uh, we have the linebackers partner up and we have one group of linebackers that are on their knees on all four and they're, they're symbolizing the officer uh, per, uh, uh, person trying to cut the outside leg and then we have the linebackers standing up in a two point stand in a ready position having their uh, feet either uh, uh, staggered outside foot back, inside foot up hands creating a V all right, where you have your thumbs together and creating a V. And then now what you want to do in order to defeat the two blocks, you teach them two eyes and two hands aiming for the crown of the helmet. And our in the crown of the helmet we call it place where the where the top of the face mask, where the screws on the face mask are in and you have that logo on our you know, have that U logo on there. And so we try to teach them that once you do this, you want to aim for that point. All right, aim here, and then as you aim and make contact, you want to slide, you want to push, and then give a step and regain ground. So we do this drill to slow things down. It's more of a teaching concept, uh, just making sure that they have the proper technique down, and then as we transition to other drills, we could pick up the tempo and do it at a faster pace and see if they really got it down. So here's the drill. We set it up. Good job here. Uh, by linebacker right here. All right. Good job. They're doing the drill. Good contact. We're trying to aim for the, for the screws. Good job by the linebacker at the top of the screen. Aiming. Giving ground. Good job here. Now regain ground. Excellent job right here. And so what you try to do is get reps to, to eat to both sides and constantly just repping it and getting a feel for that position. Then we flip them over and do the same thing. Good job here. Aim it now. You want to aim here for the face mask, not the top of the helmet. You want the crown. You want to try to bend your knees. So that's what's important. You got to bend your knees. Bend your knees, not your waist. Right here now, he's just playing a drill. We don't want to do that. We want to attack right at the screws, right at the crown of the helmet. And then now, once we make contact, then we want to we want to slide, push, and give a step. We want to slide, push, and give a step. Slide, push, and give a step. And now we just take the same drill, and then now we flip it. Now the guys that was on all four, now they're in the linebacker stance, and the guys that was linebacker stance, now they're on all fours. So it's just a way just to rotate it. Now you look at this group right here, uh, linebacker 56 is not a good job. He's hitting the back of the helmet. We don't want to do that. We want to bend our knees, aim for the crowd. Uh, same thing here. We don't want to swipe at it like that. Uh, linebacker right here. We don't want to. We don't want to swipe at it. We want to shoot our our hands, two hands, uh, two eyes. Create a V with our hands. Put our thumbs together and aim for the crown of the helmet, the screws, and then we want to give a ground. Good job right here. Good job hand, hand placement. Good job here. Now, once I place my hand on the helmet, then now I want to slide, push, and give a step. I want to give ground. I got it. I want to give ground and then I regain the ground. So good hand placement here. Just need to work on uh, linebacker 13. Need to work on once he make contact, push back. All right. Uh, give a ground and then give a step and then now I can gain ground. So same drill here. Now we're just emphasizing it, taking it to the next level, trying to put it all together. Uh, emphasizing the same parting up drill. Good job here. Now you see now I'm emphasizing once I get my hand placement. Look at number 52. All right, he's doing the proper technique, two hands, two eyes, aiming for the crown of the helmet, and now gaining ground. Now, you look at uh, 56, all right, now, I, I don't know what he's doing. He's, instead of shooting two hands, two eyes, he's only shooting one hand, and that's not what we want. Uh, same thing here with 44. Want to aim for the crown of the helmet, uh, not not on the back of the helmet. So we just constantly wrap it and wrap it until it becomes second nature for our guys to get this technique down. Good job. Regaining ground. And like I say, the purpose of the drill is teach them how to take on low blocks and stay on their feet and make plays. 
Everything we do is, is geared towards making plays, teaching our guys how to make plays, making plays, all right? Same, same drill, all right? Guys switched over now. Good job by number 36, all right? Good hand placement, giving ground, all right? He's sliding over, good. Gain ground and give ground. 32, not good, all right? 32 need to shoot, aim for the crown of the helmet. Right in the front, all right, shoot both hands. He's not doing it. He's actually swiping it, so it's going to push the defender, uh, assist defender to get to his outside leg. All right. Uh, 47 to the far left of the screen, need to bend his knees more. That's going to help him uh, hit the uh, target point with the, uh, with the crown of the helmet. And the same thing with 32. He's reaching instead of shooting his arms. He's going to reach. He want to shoot his arms to the crown of the helmet, and then he want to be able to uh, give ground to gain ground. So he's just sliding across, and he's going to get cut if he try to take that technique to the game. All right, now let's take our training to the game. Here's a situation uh, uh, last year um, versus uh, uh, Kansas State. If you look at the linebacker in the middle right here, number 31, Sean Spence does a great job. He's shuffling over. He's getting a cut block. He's two hands, two eyes. Now, look at him. He's, 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 uh, he's sliding. He's pushing himself back. He's giving ground to gain ground. Great job. Great play right here. Awesome play. He's able to come up with the big stop. All right? Let's look at it from the end zone angle. All right, shuffling over. Good. All right, two hands, two eyes, filling the ball, carrying. All right, keeping his, uh, keep it staying alive by, by giving ground as the guy's trying to roll. Uh, Really great technique by the tight end, trying to roll with the cut block. Now he's just going back, giving ground. Now he's able to come in and make that play. That's the demonstration of the one-on-one -on -one, uh, cut block drill that we do at the University of Miami.